Hey guys, it's Sapphire Phoenix here, and I am officially back from Canada now. Um, spent the first three weeks of August there. I came back on the 21st, which was last week, or whenever this video was uploaded, it was however many days back. If you can tell by my voice, I have been a bit ill the last couple of days. Um, it's starting to clear up, but I still have quite a bit a bad cough, so I will mute the microphone every now and then just to clear my throat a bit. Um, <clears throat> but I haven't recorded any fresh footage of Medieval 2 recently and I haven't got any left to upload and I kind of don't want to get left but I don't want to kind of get um, behind on my recordings so I thought I'm slightly ill but I'm not too bad I'll give it a go you know I've got a free house for the next hour or so I'll just get an, a little bit of uh, Medieval 2 done for you guys so um, Rome 2 is just around the corner as well but I'll go into more sort of talks in a second. So we're being attacked by the Mongols. And I'm more concerned about this army than the other reinforcements. Because if I show you the reinforcements, it's 86 men. And there's not a lot of men there. So um, in this one, there's... Uh, oh, God. Uh, 360 Pavis crossbowmen. So we need to be a bit careful about those guys. Obviously, the general's bodyguard as well. They can be a bit troublesome. But the cavalry, I'm not too worried about. You know, we've got a lot of spearmen. They can easily take care of them. A couple of halberd militia, I'm sure... The spear walls will do some damage to those cavalry as well. Um, I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that there's no spy that's taken out the gates or anything this time. We'll give it a go. All our people's homes are with you, men. Sorry, I had to clear my throat then. So expect that to be muted every now and then. I do have a, a drink as well. So hopefully that will help. I also bought a, recently a game called Rise and Fall Civilizations at War. I don't know if any of you guys have got it. It took me a little bit of, while, a little bit of time to get it to work on the Windows 7. Damn it! Spies open the gates. Um, yeah, it took me a bit... Ooh. Someone has opened our gates to the enemy! Cannon towers. Yeah, it took me a bit of time to get Rise and Fall to work on my computer. Because it's, window, it's a Windows XP game. And I was trying to make it work on a Windows 7 computer. So, it, um, eventually what I had to do is install the game uh, before. And then, right at the end, it comes up saying, um, it's been installed, but you need to reboot your computer. So, before you reboot your computer, you have to... Um, you have to... Uh, close the installation when it's finished and then you go and download the version 1.15 update for the game um, <coughs> which then um, after you've done that you I think you restart the computer again your, uh, you restart your computer that time there they are, I couldn't see them for a second you restart your computer yeah, by the way, you must have seen this tactic before, so, uh, you know, just pulling everyone back to the middle. Uh, these guys, are, there's only 61 of them, so I'm actually going to bring them round here. Maybe to hold off, you know, just hold the enemy off a bit. Um, so, yeah, you then restart your computer. Then when, it, when your computer loads up again, uh, you then download... Um, the driver for the game now I think you I can't remember what the website's name is you have to you'll have to google it um, you know you have to google rise and fall civilizations at war driver update uh, for Windows 7 or something like that actually I'm gonna bring the 61 to the center I might as well um, so you have to do all that to get it to work properly oh there's no one there why am I doing that and now it works perfectly fine and I've been playing I've been going through the Alexander campaign there's the Cleopatra campaign to go through as well um, so for for the time being, it's just the uh, Alexander campaign. And there's a spearman, 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 spearman general. Uh, ooh. Let's pull the spearman general down this side. Pavis crossbows can come across. Uh, 58 spearmen. They can. I'll put them there. Put these 95 just across here. And these guys will pull off the wall over here. I basically want to keep my cannon towers firing. Um, put this unit into Shiltrum formation. That will slow the cavalry down. These guys in support will slow them down even further. Give my general a chance to get back to the town center. And also give my crossbows a chance to get over here and do some damage. Um, is that everyone moving? Oh, I haven't got these guys moving. Uh, these guys over here. Who else isn't moving? These guys... Over here. Oh, okay. Um, and these guys as well. Um, pull these guys. 
there. Make sure I selected these guys to go over there. And I'm going to take all my crossbows off of skirmish mode and auto fire. I'll leave auto fire on actually. Just because I'm going to be I'm going to be too busy moving everyone around. I'm not going to really have a chance to focus on where everyone is. Um, let's, put, let's just tell these guys to go to the middle. Cannons. <coughs> Mortars. Line up there. These guys. Let's line them up at the front here. Sorted. Okay, so... Yeah, Rise and Fall, I've recently bought that, so I've been playing that. Um, if you guys fancy it, I might make a series of that eventually at some point. Obviously, Rome 2 is going to be the focus when it comes to September. Um, destroy it. Destroy that tower. Um, oh, we got some guys at the back. I forgot. Right, uh, these guys block off the entrance there. And this 95 unit can go here instead. There we go. Now they're running. Um, God save us! The enemy have the walls. Look to our defense, or all will be lost. Our men are under attack. We need to act. So yeah, I've got rise and fall. Um, uh, what else am I going to be doing? Uh, Mass Effect 2 is finished. I managed to upload the finale on the day that I got back from my holiday, so I got I did that for you guys. Um, Mass Effect 3 will be starting eventually as well. Not sure when. Um, haven't really decided. I did say in the video I was going to do it in maybe a week or so, but uh, you know we'll, we'll we'll see how things go ahead. Oh look at all this. Our men are under attack. My guys have gone. Now. Have been slaughtered here, but slaughtered the enemy there. Fantastic. And we got a load of cavalry coming around on the side over here. Right, uh, halberdiers, form up here, quick. Spearmen, halberdiers, crossbows, Our men are under uh, attack. halberdiers. We need to act. My general, oh, he got attacked. Whoops. Oopsie daisies. So what have we got over here? We got. Cavalry over here. Has reached our walls. <coughs> and skill at arms lead our way. Where's my general? Our men are under attack. Oh, we must act uh, now. Yeah, just keep running, general. We'll send you through these spearmen. Uh, we're gonna have to send them up this way. Okay. Uh, damn it! I didn't get these guys into wall formation. All these guys. God damn it! They're only light lances, though, so not too bad. Um, so yeah, Rome Two is coming out soon. Uh, just around the corner, pretty much. Um, what else is going to be going on? Uh, I'm trying to think what else I'm going to be doing. Mass Effect 3, Rome 2. This, um, Third Age, obviously. Um, Roma Serectum 2. Now, that's a question I want to lay out to you guys. When Rome 2 comes out, I'm going to be focusing quite a lot on that game because it's going to be a brand new Total War game. Everyone's going to be excited for it. Do you guys want me to continue Roma Serectum 2 as well? Or do you want me to sort of call that one a day or not. I don't know. It's it's up it's completely up to you guys. I'm just asking. I'm curious to see what you want because I don't know whether you think um Roma Serectum and then Rome 2 is going to be too much at one source. I don't know. You guys let me know. Uh what else am I going to be doing? Um I don't know. I can't think. Too busy focusing. 
Um. I'm just trying to think in my head right now what I'm going to be doing. Percentage twenty two for forty. <coughs> Excuse me, forgot to move my mic that time. Oops, never mind. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. don't know what to think. Attack. We must act now. I don't know what I'm trying to think of now. Oh, lots of cavalry moving. Where's that? Bodyguard, okay, that's fine. My unit here can hit the general from the back. That's all good. And we'll get my crossbows down off the wall. Mortars. Take some pot shots at the general for no reason. Just because it'll be fun. Go, general, go! Save the halberds! Save our halberds. Yeah, these spearmen are getting slaughtered by, by my uh, Pavi's crossbows. Brilliant. Oh. Our men have Ooh. slain the Saracen general. There goes a the general. Now we must send his men running back to the only half the enemy force remains. So what's that? Uh, thirty-five to fifty-six. Pretty good. Keep telling these guys to move, and they're not doing anything. They never do what I tell them. Right. Sixteen halberds, fourteen halberds. Let's line them up here at the back. What's that coming this way? Mongol infantry, thirty-four. Crossbows line up. Gonna bring my general over here. The infantry still standing there ready. That's fine. And they've lost a lot of infantry down here. It is unwise to praise the day before sunset. But sending all their Pavi's crossbows up. Our men are under attack. We must act now. What's going on down here? Cavalry, heavy lancers. Uh, ah, just take them out. God damn it! They're just standing there. Fire, please. <laughs> Who is shooting me? Ah, any Pavi's crossbows, that's why. In which case, uh, yeah. Only half the Come down enemy force here. Uh-oh. Oh, we are so screwed. Well, I didn't see that coming. Never mind. Those guys are getting slaughtered. Lovely jabbly. The enemy flees the battle. Run down those worthless peasants. Those guys are routed. 
I'm going to put my spearmen in there because there's a load of cavalry over in that corner, so I want to block that off. So we're on 44 for 71, not bad, not bad at all. Yeah, these guys are going to get slaughtered. these guys around here and start shooting that cavalry uh, da, 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 da. unless these guys can reach them they can yeah why not actually no no no, no. We'll get them to shoot them the enemy general has no honor the oh. lord above his kind we have captured the enemy's general that could teach the cowardly dog to run now he can rest at our leisure. Okay, so what now? Let's move these guys. <coughs> Move my spearman. Around this way. Uh, these guys over here, what are they doing? Still shooting those guys, good, good, good. Still got a load of archers on the ground. these guys off and then cut them up <laughs> oh if you're wondering what I'm going to be playing as in Rome 2 I'm going to be playing as Athens I keep getting asked that question quite a lot it's Athens it was decided a while back now so Athens uh, what I'm, there's something on the tip of my mind and I can't remember what it was I was trying to think of it's going to bother me a lot now. Nope, can't think. <laughs> I've just been trying to think, I can't. Shoot these guys. Nice. They're routing. Shoot these crossbows up here. Nice. Alright, let's move these spearmen down because nothing's happening now, so. 
Let's go. Get these guys off the wall as well, just to have a bit of backup. Open fire, please. Wow, really? You have to organize. You have to shuffle into formation first. Just shoot them. They're right there. Who's left apart from those guys? Anyone else? One cavalry unit there. That's it, really? That's it? It's just that last unit. These last Mongol archers. Send my spearmen in. Praise the Almighty! Our enemy has lost his stomach to fight. Oh, that, we'll, we'll leave it there. Heroic the victory. Above, 784, 1123, and 74. Humbled. Awesome. Brilliant. Um, ransom rejected. <sighs> awesome. Sauce. Fifteen grand to spend. Yeah, yeah, never mind. Repair the wall. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Let's merge these two. Yes. One, two, three. Three, oh, three units over a hundred. Two at one hundred fifty. That's fine. Um. Three, four, five, six. Make that four crossbows. One more halberdier. Retrain the halberdier, and then retrain the other two units. Okay. Uh, ooh, hand gunners and pike militia. Let's see, pike militia are seven for one. Halberd militia are five for one. So yeah, the pike militia are better. So we get a barracks then. Okay. Oh yeah, my army heading to yes. Magdeburg. As you will, my lord. We march to battle. You will fall to my power. Blah, 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 blah. Great thing about me being slightly ill is I can make my voice do things like that. You will fall to my might. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, I'm gonna have so much fun doing that. For the little amount of time I have to do it. So there's not really a lot going on. Um, uh, what am I going to do? I do want to take Nicosia. 
but I won't be able to leave a good enough garrison behind <coughs> in Constantinople. Not to defend, not to defend against this army anyway. Come face me. Unless I can. <laughs> I don't know. I believe that is the last province apart from Sofia that they have. That's right, that'll be one enemy less to worry about. So I can head round and attack. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll recruit six spears. Well, we'll do the first three, put them into the town, move my army out, because the, by the next turn, the other three will spawn, will be retrained automatically, so that'd be good. Um, where am I sending you? I'm not sending you anywhere, am I? I'm still at war with France. That is impossible. Ooh, hello Portugal. I'm at war with Milan. Luckily I'm not at war with um the Holy Roman Empire yet. Approaching, my lord. Camping here, my lord. Your Majesty. Very well.